Right, hi everybody, I'm back again. I've had a bit of a look and a shifty around uh, to see what I've got. Um, and I'm going to use some of these. I got that off of um, Fiona from her Etsy store. Um, this was actually a pair of earrings um, that I bought from Primark. Um, and it was sort of joined on like that. Um, if I wore them on my ears, they would, my ears would be down by the floor. They'd, I just wouldn't. But I just thought they were really, they weren't expensive. And I just, there was obviously two, so I chopped them up. And I've got this really fab, two fab, big, you know, gems and two little ones. So I might use one of these. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I've got some pearl beads and also this... Um, quite vintage looking trim which um, I also got off of um, it was on a string of um, ribbon and lots of beads and stuff and I took it to pieces because I didn't like it how it was so but what I'm what I'm going to do so if I just move these aside a minute what I want to do is starting from this corner let me just trim this off I want to uh, sort of twist these together, sort of wrap them round together and sort of so they're so wrapped round each other. Oh, I might just cut that bit off because it's just cut that bit off by that knot. Yeah, so. Yeah, so sort of twist them round together and then so yes I'm going to do that. Okay. Right, so I'm going to start here. Put them there. Start off in that corner. Oops, and then I'm going to twist them around because I don't. What I want them to do is to be. I want them to be sort of dangly, but not. I don't want them to be tight, but sort of to stick out like that. So I put a bit of glue in the middle there. They go around and then glue them there. Oh, put my finger on the glue instead of the beads. I can always cut them with the, with the beads, so I want them to be sort of like that all the way around. That's a bit too dangling. Oops, what's happened here?
bits. There we go. And again here, just twist it so they're together but not tight. And then add some glue to the middle. Just twist it around a bit. Add some glue. It's all quiet in my house at the moment. My little one's asleep, he's got school tomorrow. He hates school. Poor thing. He could be taught at home, he would like, rather stay at home. Um, bless him. But they gotta go. So, that's that one. I'll do this side. I watched uh, Pierce Brosnan this evening with um, interviewing Kelly Osborne. Oh God, she looked amazing. What, what, a, what a childhood that kid had. I think my kids think I got it bad. They got it bad sometimes. <laughs> that poor kid. Oh, bless her. With wealth and fame comes great responsibility. Probably even more so when you've got children for, you know, but yes. Oh, just burnt my nail. Wasn't it Spider-Man's granddad that said that? <laughs> oh. Glue all over me. I'll stick it down. Nearly finished. Let's glue this side down. We've had the X Factor tonight as well. Na um, in actual fact, um, Ryland left, bless him. I know he couldn't sing, but oh god, he, he was funny. So, but um, Jamal um, lives, um, mum, and that lives just down the road for me actually, and he works in the. In, well, he used to, not now, obviously. He used to work in the uh, shop that I used to shop in. I'm sure I'm not the only one, but, you know, I mean, what I'm saying is, is my claim to fame is I live in the same village as uh, Germ Germaine and uh, went shopping at the shop he worked at. <laughs> That's my claim to fame. Because I'm sure that young lad will go far and will be famous, as they say. Right, okay. Oh. Where's my end? Ah, there's my end. Okay, so I'm going to trim that off. There we go. So that's now all the way around the edge of my notice, notice board. So, very pretty. 
very pretty. Right, okay, so I'm just going to finish off by just adding the last bits of my, um, um, what I don't, what I want to do is just sort of cover this, this sort of corner here and not go into obviously this bit here. So, I've got a nice big, what do they call it? Uh, I don't know what that is. It's not a calla lily, I don't know, it's not a calla lily. Calla lilies are the long thin ones. Um, I don't know what that is. It's a flower. I don't know what it is. But anyway, it's going on my uh, project, whatever it is. Okay. And then I've got... Where have they all gone? That, oh yeah, that one. Some of that, some of that. Okay, so I've got um, some more green ones to go here. Oops. Now, do I stick that down there? What do you think? Do you know what? I think I just might. I think I just might. What do you think? That's a lovely bling. Just stick it there. Mmm. Delicious blinginess. Yammers. one here. Just trim this one up a bit. strings
straight wrong pot great that you can use other embellishments to hide over a, a, a multitude of sin. Oops! Also helps to strengthen that bit there as well. Okay, let's go. I don't know what you think. Do I need to put anything else? Let's zoom out. Oops, where are we? Oh, where's the corner gone? There it is. What do you think? Do I need to? something dangling down from there. Maybe I don't know what have I got. I could, I could put a stick pin in as well, I suppose. I made that last night. I think the beads on that might be the wrong colour. Yep. Thinks I go quite nicely there. All right, let's just put that on. That'd be nice. Let's cut some of this as well. Let's see. On there. Oh, I did that little cherub. I wonder if I could put. What do you think? If I put a little cherub there. Just took 
What do you think? There we go. There's my notice board project. Um, I'll find something to stick in it. So you just so you get the idea. What have I got? I've got. I haven't got anything. Oh look, there we go. A bit of paper. I don't want to really waste that by stick slide whatever you want underneath it and I'm quite pleased with how that turned out and you can do a big one a small one I might just find a stick pin to go in in there just to so there we go what do you think oh, I hope you like it thank you for joining me bye